My name is Gemma New and I'm a conductor. Uh, in Baltimore for two years, I studied with Gustav Meyer. You know, one thing he said was, uh, show the music, show everything. And that was to do with the detail of the score and studying those details. And, and you know, he said an hour a page, that was another good point of advice um, there, how much time one needs to take with every bar of a piece. Um, so he really inspired one to be thorough, um, but he also said less is more. So showing the music and then also having less is more, I'm still always trying to find that balance. Simon Rattle, I absolutely admire his work and his uh, whole career trajectory. And I'd just love to ask him a whole bunch of questions about it. I was preparing to perform with an orchestra that I greatly admired. And for a whole year, I'd been looking forward to this moment. And um, we got to the first rehearsal and the first piece went very well. I timed everything out of my head, of, you know, about how we're going to be efficient with this rehearsal. And uh, second piece, it was something quite soft and simple. And somehow my bet on, I didn't have it quite in my grasp and it hit the stand and went flying. And I was so embarrassed. Uh, my face must have gone beetroot red. Um, but, uh, you know, obviously don't want to waste any time with, with that. We were on the, the, the job and uh, kept going with the rehearsal, of course. Um, at the break, uh, this very kind violist came up and he said, you know, Bernstein used to do that all the time and you're in good company. Okay, uh, I, uh, I did really enjoy watching Game of Thrones <laughs> when it was on, and I, I loved um, Aya because she was really strong, a great fighter, and thought she was fearless. I'm, I'm not sure we have the same goals, but uh, <laughs> uh, definitely I liked her spunk. Favorite composer, that is something I'm asked a lot and I never know how to answer it. Um, but at this time, I love Brahms. I find uh, his, the construction of his work is so inspiring. It's uh, very complex. It has all those layers which you can delight in. Um, and also emotionally, uh, there is that uh, melancholy, but also sunlight. And I think we need to have that balance right now.